Hi everybody, it's me, Vicki. Today is um, my fifth day of carb cycling um, because, well yesterday was my fourth, I didn't make a video, um, I totally spaced. Yesterday was my son's fourth birthday, so I spent the day with him um, and not recording myself. <laughs> Anyways, so update on yesterday. Yesterday was low carb day and it was kind of rough for me because I was at home and um, I'm a bit of a grazer at home, um, but yesterday I made sure I was snacking on cashews instead of anything else. Um, so yesterday I did good. Um, it was hard for me to keep track of eating every three hours because me and my son was so busy and I was party planning and all sorts of craziness, but um, I had my meals prepped already and my snacks and I ate them. I'm just not sure I ate them around the time I was supposed to. And I made my son, um, coconut vanilla cupcakes last night. Who does that on low carb day? Honestly, cupcakes? Really? Bad idea. I tried so hard to resist, but they were so good and they were clean. Does that matter? Oh, they were so good. But I only had one, and it was a small one. And there was no frosting. So, kudos for me. <sighs> Anyways, so like I said, this week is trial and error. Next week, I'm going to know everything that there is to know about low carb, high carb, carb cycling, what to eat, what not to eat, how much to eat. It'll be good. So, this week is practice round, right? Um,. But yeah, I'm excited to see if the scale changes this weekend or measurements. Um, and today's high carb day. And already I had my overnight oats and two egg whites, three egg whites with bell pepper. And uh, it's hard to, to eat that much for me in the morning. But because um, I'm used to my Shakeology, that's so delicious. Um, but yeah, so high carb day big workout day. We'll see how it goes. Um, tomorrow is supposed to be my cheat day. So, uh, I will update you. Have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe to my videos.